Welcome to our course on Python for Data Science. In this course, we'll cover some fundamental programming concepts of Python, with a focus on data science. At the end of the course, we will get hands-on experience of two project case studies. First is function approximation and the second one is classification case study. And show you how to solve them using the programming skills you will learn during the course. In this introductory lecture, we will define what is data science and also understand why Python is an excellent choice for data science. Data science is the practice of analyzing raw data and to extract valuable insights from them. These insights can be derived using various techniques, ranging from simple statistical methods to more advanced machine learning algorithms. The primary goal of data science is to uncover these insights, regardless of the techniques used. These days there is a lot of excitement around data science because it's been proven to provide valuable insights from large datasets. By analyzing large amounts of data, we can better understand how different variables interact and affect one another, which isn't always easy to see through simple calculations. However, deriving these insights requires time and effort to learn how to analyze the data effectively. From a practical standpoint, data science helps industries to make better decisions. These decisions can span multiple areas, such as improving purchasing decisions, hiring decisions, and operational processes and many other areas. In data science, we start with the assumption that we have a large amount of data related to the problem we're trying to solve. We then inspect, clean, and curate the data before transforming and modeling it to derive valuable insights that can benefit organizations or help test scientific theories. Now, let's discuss about the practical steps involved in solving a data science problem. Suppose you have been given some data, and your goal is to derive insights from it. Once you have the data, there are four primary steps you will need to follow. 1. Read the data. The first step is to import the data into your system, regardless of its format, like Excel, CSV, etc. We'll teach you how to read data from various formats into your programming platform. 2. Process and clean the data. After importing the data, you'll need to process and clean it. This step involves checking for errors, such as incorrect data, like a mobile number with only 5 digits instead of 10, or missing values. We will also show you how to use Python tools to clean and process your data, making it usable for further analysis. 3. Summarize the data. Once you have cleaned and processed the data, the next step is to summarize it. This can be done using simple statistical measures, such as calculating the median, mode, or mean of a particular column. Summarizing the data helps you better understand its key characteristics and patterns. 4. Analyze and model the data. After summarizing the data, you'll move on to more advanced analysis and modeling techniques. This step involves using machine learning algorithms, data visualization, and other tools to derive valuable insights from the data. In this course, we'll focus on the first three steps, providing you with a solid foundation for data processing, cleaning, and summarization using Python. We'll also introduce you to some basic analysis and modeling techniques to help you get started with deriving insights from your data. After summarizing the data, the next step is visualization. Visualization involves creating graphical representations of the data to gain insights and better understand its attributes. This is a creative aspect of data science, as the same data can be visualized in various ways, with some visualizations being more informative and eye-catching than others. In this course, we'll teach you how to use Python tools for data visualization. At this point, you've cleaned the data, created a usable data structure, performed basic summarization, and visualized the data to gain insights. However, with large datasets, there may still be insights that aren't immediately apparent through simple summaries or visualizations. To uncover these hidden insights, more sophisticated analytics and analysis techniques are required. This is where machine learning comes in. As you progress through this course, you'll learn how to approach data science problems in a structured manner and use Python as a tool to solve these problems. 
This includes learning machine learning techniques to derive valuable insights from complex datasets. By the end of the course, you'll be well equipped to tackle data science problems using Python, from data cleaning and summarization to visualization and machine learning. You may be wondering why we choose Python for data science. The primary reason is the existence of large number of powerful Python libraries that are specifically designed to perform the tasks related to data science. These libraries make it easy to program and quickly achieve interesting results. Now let's discuss about how Python libraries support different aspects of data science like data manipulation and preprocessing. There are numerous Python libraries for data wrangling, manipulation, and preprocessing. These libraries make it easy to clean, process, and transform your data into a usable format. Data summary. You need many statistical calculations to be performed for data summarization which are already pre-programmed in Python libraries. You can simply invoke these functions with your data to generate summaries. Visualization. Python offers a variety of libraries for data visualization, enabling you to create informative and eye-catching visualizations to better understand your data. Advanced analysis. For more sophisticated analysis, such as machine learning, a wide range of algorithms are pre-coded and available as Python libraries. This allows you to quickly apply these techniques to your data without having to implement the algorithms from scratch. By using Python and its extensive ecosystem of libraries, you can streamline your data science workflow and focus on deriving valuable insights from your data. Once you become familiar with Python and its libraries, applying machine learning algorithms to your data science problems becomes straightforward. You can simply call the appropriate library functions and run the algorithms at a high level. In addition to the advantages, we've already discussed, Python offers several other benefits that make it well-suited for data science, beyond just simple data science tasks like Continuous improvement, Python's libraries are constantly being updated and improved, with new algorithms and features regularly added. This ensures that you have access to the latest techniques and tools for data science. Extensive libraries, Python offers a wide variety of libraries, making it a versatile choice for data science. This diversity allows you to tackle a broad range of problems and applications. Active user community, Python has a large and active user community, which contributes to its development and provides support for troubleshooting and resolving issues. This community helps ensure that the libraries you use are robust and reliable. Ease of use, Python syntax is simple and easy to learn, making it an ideal choice for beginners and experts alike. Its readability and consistency help you focus on solving problems rather than getting lost in language details. Scalability. Python can handle large datasets and complex computations, making it suitable for projects of all sizes. Its ability to scale ensures that you can tackle even the most challenging data science problems. By choosing Python for your data science needs, you'll benefit from its extensive libraries, continuous improvement, active user community, ease of use, and scalability. These advantages make Python a powerful and versatile tool for solving a wide range of data science problems. In this course, we'll be working with reasonably small datasets, but in real-life scenarios, you'll often encounter much larger datasets, known as big data. Python has the ability to integrate with big data frameworks like Hadoop and Spark, making it a versatile choice for handling large-scale data processing tasks. Python also supports more advanced programming standards, such as object-oriented programming and functional programming. Despite its sophisticated tools and capabilities, Python remains a relatively simple language to learn, with fast prototyping capabilities. It also allows you to work with data stored on your local machine or in the cloud, providing flexibility for various use cases. When considering a programming platform for solving real-world problems, Python stands out due to its ability to handle large datasets, support for advanced programming models, and ease of use. With Python, you can build real-life data science applications, not just simple examples. Another reason why Python is an excellent choice for students and professionals due to its open-source nature. 
According to a survey, most people prefer open source tools for various reasons, including cost and the presence of a robust user community. Python excels in both aspects, being both free to use and supported by a strong user community. Learning Python offers numerous advantages, including better job opportunities and a strong user community to help you along the way. This makes Python an excellent choice for those looking to build a career in data science or related fields. With this, we conclude our brief introduction on why Python is an excellent choice for data science. Throughout this course, we'll teach you Python as a programming language, with a focus on its applications in data science. As we progress through the modules, we'll highlight the connections between Python concepts and their usage in data science. We'll conclude this course with two case studies that demonstrate how to apply the skills you've learned to solve real-world data science problems using Python. Our goal is to provide you with a strong foundation in both Python and data science, enabling you to tackle more complex challenges as you continue to develop your skills. We hope that this course will help you quickly get started with Python and data science. By the end of this course, you'll have a solid understanding of how to use Python to solve data science problems, setting you up for success in your future learning. Thank you for joining us, and we look forward to helping you on your data science journey. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe to our channel for more engaging content on Python and data science. Stay tuned for upcoming videos in this series, as we dive deeper into the world of Python programming and its applications in data science.